What's up guys? This is Shivam here and welcome to the another video on my channel Geeky Droid. Now in today's video I'm going to show you the top 10 hidden feature your Android smartphone contains but you are unaware about it. So without wasting any more of your time, let's get started. Number 1. The Hidden Developer Option Which isn't too much of a secret these days, but I definitely can't live without. So to enable the Hidden Developer Options, just go to the Settings, scroll down and go in the About Phone section and tap 6 to 7 times on the build number till a banner appears showing you are a developer. Now you will see a new option about the About Phone section. Now this is the developer options. It contains tons of cool features which in turn will enhance user experience over your Android smartphone. Let's have a look at all. Number 2. Google Screen Search Nowadays, almost all the Android smartphones contains an inbuilt Google app. You just have to open it, go in the settings and select the screen search. Now enable the first option. Now basically what it does is like if you are surfing on a smartphone and an unknown thing pops up and you don't know what it is, you just have to long press your home button then Google will search your screen and will give you all the information it has regarding the topic what currently lies on your screen. A really cool feature, right? But still. Many of the Android users are unaware about it. Number 3. Saving Web Page as PDF As the name suggests, this is a trick for converting the web page into PDF format. And for that, you just have to click the bulletin icon and choose Share and then click on the print option. Thus you will be able to transform the web page into PDF format. Despite being a little trick, this can come in handy many a times. Number 4. Screen Pinning You guys must have been in a situation when your friend asks your phone to make a phone call and after he's done with the call, he starts messing up with your phone, like reading your private chats or checking your gallery. It's really annoying. Now that's where screen pinning comes in handy. To enable it, just go in the settings, security and then screen pinning. Just turn it on. Also you make sure to enable the first option. And when you will click on the recent tab, a pin-like icon will appear on the app card and when you will touch it, the current screen will get pinned. Now the user won't be able to get out of the app as the back and the home button becomes unresponsive. Also he won't be able to access the notification toolbar. Now to unpin the screen, just hold the back button and just enter your password and the screen will get unpinned. Number 5. Flex Storage In a smartphone, the number of apps is inversely proportional to the internal storage. So, as the number of apps increases, the internal storage decreases. Though, nowadays, the internal storage of the Android smartphones, which are 16 or 32 gigabytes, but still, they are not enough. So to counter this problem, a new feature came into account after the launch of Android 6.0 Marshmallow, that is converting the SD card into internal storage. So to enable that, just go in the settings, storage and USB and click on the SD card. Here you will find 4 options and choose the format as internal. Just confirm your pin and click on erase and format. 
But before doing that, make sure that you do have a backup of the data that currently lies within the SD card as all the data is erased in the process. Number 6. Offline Google Maps Now this is not a hidden feature but it is a very useful trick which will save a lot of your data and time. And for that, you just have to go to the Google Map app and just hit on settings and choose the offline map and select your own map. And from here, you can select a bunch of your area which you frequently visit either for your private or professional purpose and just hit on download. And the selected area will get downloaded and will be saved offline. Number 7. Magnification Gestures Now to enable it, just go in the settings, then in the accessibility center, and then in the magnification gestures and just turn it on now you can just zoom in and out of the screen by just triple tapping on it also you can drag it by using two or more fingers across the screen now this little feature comes in handy while you are trying to access a website on your smartphone but it is not available for the mobile version so you can just magnify it and then you will be able to see the contents of the desktop version website the hidden Android Easter Eggs Now every Android version has its own specific Easter Eggs and for that go in the settings then in the about phone section and just tap a bunch of times over the Android version. Now the logo of your specific Android will appear. Again tap 2-3 to three times and just long press on it. Now the game of your Android will begin. Looks a lot like Flappy Bird, but a little bit more difficult than that. The next hidden game is in the Chrome web browser. Just go to any website, but make sure you are offline. And just tap over this dinosaur and the game will begin. You just have to tap on the screen and make this dinosaur hop over the cactus. Now the third hidden game is in the Facebook Messenger app. Just go in the Messenger, then in the Emoji section and in the Football section. Then just choose the first option of Football, just send it and tap over it. Then the game of Football will begin. Also you can choose the second option of the Basketball. Again just send it and tap over it. Thus you can challenge your friend with the help of these two cool games. Have fun! Notification Log Widget Let me ask you, have you ever had a notification pop up on your phone and you either swipe it away without thinking or maybe disappear before you saw it and you are like oh no, what did it say and you didn't see it? Well. This will solve that. You just have to long press on your home screen. Now go into widgets. This might look a little bit different depending on what phone you have. And then you have to find the settings shortcut. Now just drag and drop it to your home screen. Then it will show you a selection of different settings. And just choose the notification log. In it, you can scroll through all your recent notifications. A simple but very useful trick. Force 4x MSAA Many of the Android users use their smartphone for some hardcore 3D gaming purposes, like playing Asphalt 8, Modern Combat 5 or FIFA. But many a times, due to insufficient RAM or not having a good processor, the device starts to lag. So to fix this problem, just go in the settings, then in the developer option, and then scroll down till you find the Force 4x MSAA option, and just enable it. 
Now you will be able to enjoy a high graphics 3D game much more smoothly than before. But make sure that you do turn it off as soon as you are done with the game as it consumes a lot of power. Alright guys, that's it for today's video of the top 10 hidden features slash tricks of your Android smartphone. If you like it, then please give a big thumbs up and if you haven't subscribed to my channel, then please kill the red button. Till then, sayonara.